Looking ahead. If you are looking for something special to do this Mother's Day weekend, you might consider a trip downtown for the Mayfest Arts Fair. We're happy to be joined now by Catherine Minton of the Downtown Lexington Corporation. Thanks very much for coming in. Thanks for having me. For somebody who has never been before, uh, or maybe if they have been before, tell us what, what will be new, what will be happening this year at Mayfest. Well, we're happy to celebrate the 21st year of Mayfest down at Gratz Park and Transylvania University. There's really something for everyone. There's art, photography, pottery, jewelry, and a ton of activities for the kids to do. What do you think it is about this event that makes it so special? Because people who go there want to go year after year. I think everyone enjoys being in a beautiful space. Gratz Park and Transy, you couldn't ask for something prettier. And being outdoors, it's just a lot of fun. So we hope the weather holds off. I was going to say, the weather hasn't always cooperated so That's nicely, true. but it really does look good for this weekend. You have that wonderful uh, shaded area there for the yes. most part. Uh, do people uh, enjoy coming and meeting with the, the artists uh, and the creators themselves? Oh, yes. I think it's always nice to find out um, a story behind a particular piece you're interested in and to meet the person who made that. Well, give us an idea of the range of artwork that will be there. Um, anything from pottery, um, art, original paintings, jewelry, all of the items. This is a jury craft fair, so all the items are handmade. And things will be for sale, too, if you're looking for that, if your mom happens yes. to be there and you're looking for that special gift. If you still need a gift, there's plenty to choose from, or if you just want to come down and buy something for yourself. Mm -hmm. Catherine, is it mostly uh, local artists who are there, or they come from all over? All over. So we're very excited. I think there's about 75 artists and there's some from Lexington, but Tennessee, Missouri, Ohio. I know that you really designed this as a family affair. Talk about the, uh, the things that kids can do and enjoy at Mayfest. So we have a free uh, children's activity area. There will be arts and crafts there. And then we have a couple um, things that for a nominal fee they can participate in, like um, the pirate ship and mm -hmm. the petting zoo and riding the ponies and the face painting. So there really is something for everyone. A lot of activity. Well, yeah, this is bound to have a, have a pretty good reputation regionally, uh, you know, or even around the country, really, with people coming in from all over for it, right? Yes, Mayfest has won a couple of awards, and we're very proud of that. And we're so proud that this is uh, the 21st year. And I think that speaks to how much people really enjoy the event. Well, very all good. Right. And, here and it, it is comes. this weekend. May 9th and 10th at Gratz Park and Transy there, again under those beautiful shade trees, and it should be uh, good weather for that, it looks like. Thanks for coming. Thank you for Appreciate having it. me. Enjoy.